Welcome to Classic Game Room. What happens when two things that taste great taste even better together in reverse with music? You get this game, Retrograde. Spaceship shooting meets Guitar Hero. Backwards. It's very good. There's a lot of things that you just don't mix together. My favorite example is tequila and mayonnaise. Try that and you'll see why. It was many years ago that I lost that bet and it still haunts my nightmares. Fortunately, two things that do go well together are spaceship shooters and the music game genre. Retrograde is better than tequila and mayonnaise. In fact, it's better than a lot of things. Except, like so many indie games on Steam, they really need to work on the title. This could have been named so many other cool things to reflect the style of the game and how good it is. Because Retrograde is a lot of fun, it's a spaceship shooter played in reverse. I'm using the Xbox 360 controller for Windows here, but you can also use a guitar controller. So yeah, it's basically Gradius meets Guitar Hero. So here's the deal, when the game starts, you win the game! You've defeated the end boss and start to watch the credits. Except, there's a problem with the space-time continuum and you have to fly through your entire game backwards. Dodging enemy fire and collecting your own shots, which remove points from the score. So it's, it's like, um, what's that game? Golf! Or is it bowling? Where the lowest score wins. Once you get into it, it's a pretty straightforward game. For the most part, you tap your button to the beat and stay out of harm's way. The more shots you collect in a row increases your multiplier and you can also pick up some star power, for lack of a better word. You're scored in roughly the same way as Guitar Hero. Nice Rick Astley reference, all right. I started off by playing all the way through casual. Just to get the hang of the game, it's not that hard to get through. But you'll have to be a real pro to get high up on the global leaderboards. Now there's multiple difficulty levels. And yes, they do get much harder. As you can plainly see and hear with your earballs, the audio and video quality are excellent. In fact, I even like the music in the game. Maybe not as much as I like the Scorpions, but, you know, not all music can be perfect. I think it's cool that this is a music rhythm game where you're also required to keep an eye on the left and right side of the screen because there's alien spaceships shooting at you. Maybe Guitar Hero needs more of that. I have a classic game room shout out and thank you to send to my friend Shard Shinjuku on Steam. Yes, I do seem to like these kinds of games and I enjoy this one. Although I still think they could have used a snappier title. How about classic game rooms intergalactic dance boogie blasterama? Seven. Retrograde, or perhaps it's pronounced Retrograde, I'm, I'm not sure actually, it's a good question. Is uh, available on Steam, it's an affordable download and totally worth it if you like music games and spaceship shooters. Thanks again Shard, and to all of the fans on Steam who have sent games, there's already a massive backlog. There's so much fun to be had in so few hours in the day, well at least you can devote some of them to Retrograde. Retrograde. 